Hello and welcome to Saki Tech. So in today's video, I'm going to go over the wallpapers in the newly released iOS 7. And as you know, iOS 7 now has live wallpapers. So let's uh, go and take a look at that one real quick. Go to the settings. And um, typically you just go to the regular settings, you swipe down, you go to brightness and wallpaper, and then you click choose a wallpaper. From here, if you look right here, it says dynamic, and here it says stills. So the still wallpapers are non-moving wallpapers, okay? And the dynamic wallpapers are what we call in the Android world the live wallpapers. So when you click that, to get you started there, there's only two choices. I'm sure they'll come up with more. So let's uh, play with these guys, see what they look like. Okay? So as you can see, there's some dynamic action going on in the background. And then you can set this for both the home screen and the lock screen. Okay, so swipe over here, and as you can see, there's some movement. Now, even with the static images, the static backgrounds, you get some kind of effect, which I'm going to show you right now. You actually get a nice sense of dimension. So let's uh, set the background here. Set both. Go to home screen and if you carefully look on the screen you will see that the items the icons are floating on the back image so that's a nice sense of dimension that that was uh, added to the iOS 7 which is a feature that actually was present in the iOS 6 jailbreak so it looks like iOS 7 Apple implemented that feature which is a very welcome feature it gives um, dynamism to the otherwise static iOS 6 and everything before that that we have been used to. Uh, so uh, that's pretty much it for the uh, static and uh, still images. Again, you go to wallpaper and you can either choose dynamic and you can choose stills. And hopefully, uh, as far as dynamic backgrounds go, we'll have more and more additions by the time iOS 7 is finalized. Well, thanks for watching this video, guys. Uh, subscribe to my channel for more videos to come. You can follow me on Facebook, you can follow me on Twitter, and I also encourage you to give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Once again, thank you and uh, have a good day.